Hi everybody, my name is Mr. Jacob and we are at the Chillicothe Public Library and we are going to do a virtual story time. So, this story time is called Toddler Story Time, but obviously anybody of any age can watch this, whether you're 2, whether you're 10, however old, it doesn't matter. Uh, we thought that we would do this virtual story time because some of you guys expressed that you can't always make toddler story time and it might be a good idea to record at least the books that we talk about so that you have them uh, to read together at home. If you are able to make it to toddler story time, it's every Friday at 10 a.m. We do songs, we do dancing, we do uh, obviously our books, and then we always do a fun craft. But if you can't make it, no worries. We'll all still be here doing our toddler story time. And... Um, we look forward to seeing you, whether it's virtual or in person. So, today, we are going to be reading The Ice Cream Vanishes by Julia Sarcone Roach. So, let's check it out. Keep your eye on the acorn. I'm squirrel. I'm a natural at making snacks disappear. Exceptional at eating them. Brilliant at hiding them, and as soon as I figure out the right magic words, I'll be the amazing squirrel vanisher of snacks by magic. I just need to sniff out the right snack and the right magic words. Abracadabra! I've tried many different snacks. I've chattered every magic word I could think of and did all my fanciest tail switches. Presto! Scoop! Scurry! Scram! Acorn be gone But no luck. The acorn doesn't budge. By the swoosh of my tail, please. Just then, a song jingled through the trees. And that is when I saw it. Hello? It is soft and cold, like a sweet summer snowball. This is ice cream! A chill zips down my tail. Could this be magic? This might be the snack I've been looking for. I know just I know just who to, can help make me it make it disappear. I scamper to our spot and find a warm lump snoring in the sunshine. I set down the ice cream. Waking bear takes all four paws. Good morning! Rise and shine! Wake up, bear! You've got to try this! And sometimes, many loud magic words. But when we turn around, the ice cream is gone! I put it right there! On this hot rock, in the sun, it's vanished. There could be only one explanation. I was a magician at last. Could we find more ice cream to disappear? My nose twitches, my ears perk, perk up. I hear the faraway call of the ice cream. Oh. We follow the song. It stops, but we keep going. It leads us to a cave full of snacks to practice magic on, and hats. Piles of top hats and party hats. I'm excited to try it again. I hope I can do it. Bear's ready to put on a show. Step right up, step right up. Birds and bugs, rodents and reptiles, furry, feathery, scaly creatures of all kinds. Direct from the branches above, it's the amazing squirrel. Vanisher of snacks, here to dazzle you with an act so incredible, it must be seen to be believed. Prepare to be astounded. Feast your eyes on this beautiful and delicious ice cream. Watch as my assistant bear covers it with mat the mystical napkin. Listen as I say the magic word, Abracadabra. And then behold, the ice cream vanishes. Except, it didn't. Maybe the ice cream didn't hear me. Maybe that wasn't the right magic word. I try again. Presto! Ice cream gone... Gone and be gone, oh! By the switch of my tail, scoot, scurry, scream. Please, still no. 
What had I said to make the ice cream vanish before? I took a deep breath. Remember the sunshine and the snoring? I had it. Wake up, bear! You've got to try this! It worked! We did it! Ta-da! The ice cream vanished. Don't ask me how it's done. A good magician never reveals their secrets, but a great magician always shares the snacks. The show was such a hit that everyone wanted to make things disappear. Inside there, inside, there were icy crunchers for the raccoons, sweet snowballs for the bunnies, shivery drippers for the birds, and so many hats. It turns out that we were all good at magic. Once every crumb, drop, and sprinkle had disappeared, everyone left with a belly full of magic, a tale of adventure, and a party hat. I took one last treat away for later. Burrow into bear, and between snores we mutter magic words. And when we woke up, once again the ice cream had vanished. But I wasn't surprised. I am the amazing squirrel, and together, Bear and I are very good at making snacks disappear. So good, we could even do it in our sleep. Alright guys, thank you for reading that. I know that might have been a little long for some of our people, some of the kiddos watching, but you did great! And if you want to spend some more time with that book, it is a brand new book we just got, and you are welcome to come check it out at the library. Once again, it is The Ice Cream Vanishes by Julia Sarcone Roach. And we look forward to seeing you next time. Stop by. Bye, everybody.